I wonder if this is an interesting one. Chie is really close to the body in the closet. This is bad. Is there something I could do? How do we get her away from the body? Stand in front of the closet? Hand her a nearby book? Or bump into a nearby bookcase? She might look over there. I have to try bumping this bookshelf. Oh, dangerous. What? So, sorry, I accidentally bumped into the bookshelf. Are you hurt? I'm fine, but I don't know about the books. Hmm? This! What a fantastic looking book! It says, interview, will you go to heaven? Oh, thank goodness. Are you going to read that in a different room? Of course. Chie, now happy, quickly exited the library. That was a close one. I'm glad she found a book that looked interesting to her. The longer she stayed in here, the more worrisome. Well, let's get this room set up. I'll try to keep anybody else from coming in here. You go on ahead. Gotcha. Say, there's something I've been thinking about the mystery novel's burning time trick. You said in the story that it needed gasoline and a fuse, right? Yeah, but does this place even have those things? I haven't found any gasoline. But if we don't find any gasoline, is there something else we could use that burns just as well? Something that burns. Got it. I'll try looking. Then the fuse. Got a good idea for that one. Hmm. Well, there's no way we'd have something as literal as that. Well, if we can't use the typical fuse, then is there something else we could use instead? I'm sure there's something. I'll look for a fuse substitute as well. Okay, then I'll head back and keep up the appearance that Osamu is alive for now. What about your nice idea from earlier? It, yeah, I'm on it. Oh, okay. Alright, then the two of us talking here might be seen as suspicious. Let's hold off talking for now. I'll talk to you later. Okay. Going over what we talked about, I'll need to find a substitute for gasoline and a fuse. What the hell could I use though? Speaking of which, there is a stove style heater in here. This uses kerosene, I believe. That would be a good replacement for the gasoline. But with the way it is now, I won't be able to take it out. What should I do if I don't hurry up? It's a PET bottle. I could use this to hold the kerosene. Oh yeah, there's a heater in here. I'm always cold. I know that I should be looking through the other rooms, but I'm so warm here. Damn it, Rentaro is by the heater. Like this, I can't take out the kerosene. Is there a way I can get him away from it? If I don't hurry up, someone could find the body. I'm running out of time. There's all sorts of medical related things in the box. Oh, this is, it's a hot pack. 
If I give this to Rintaro, maybe he'll leave the heater? Oh, great Buddha, give me strength. Oh yeah, Chia is in this room. Oh yes, this ceremony should bring us strength. The storage room was not big enough to summon this kind of magical power. Chie still doesn't seem to notice me. She's really focused. All around Chie are a bunch of lit candles. Those candles. I could maybe use one of those as a fuse. But she's using them right now. If anybody tried to take those candles right now, I think she would fight back. No doubt. But first, the kerosene. Let's try giving this hot pack to Rintaro to use. Here, Rintaro. I found this in the infirmary. A hot pack? Hooray! Wow, thanks. This will keep me warm while I search. You got this for me to use? You're really nice. After saying that, Rentaro left the room. Alright, there's nobody in the classroom now. First, it'd be dangerous to touch the heater when it's on, so I turn it off. Okay, and... Alright, I've got something that I can use to make the fire stronger with. Even if I do that, I still need something to delay the burning time though. It's incense. Yeah, these take some time to burn, right? Wouldn't this be a good replacement for a fuse? Alright, I've got the tools. Let's return to Maki. Hmm? I can hear footsteps. Is someone coming? Quickly, I hide the kerosene bottles and incense inside one of the desks. Oi. What are you doing? Nothing. I'm just inspecting this room, that's all. Oh, really? Well, I gotta go now. It'd be bad if Ko caught on to me. Once I leave, I'll have to return for those hidden incense and bottles later. Hey, hold on. I'm not finished talking to you. Wh what There's something else? This heater. Last time I was in here, it was running, but now it's out of fuel. C crap Do you know what happened to the fuel? Why is there no fuel left? I don't know anything. Ventaro was just using it, or I might remember something. Ventaro? Yeah, Rintaro said he's always cold. That's why he had it on the highest setting. Hmm, really. I asked because it looked like you were doing something shady, but I guess I was mistaken. I'll try looking in another room. After saying that, Ko left the room. That was close. It looks like Ko went to another room. Making sure that there was nobody else around, I retrieved the kerosene bottles and incense from inside the desk. Now I need to return to Maki. I've got the tools. Will these work in place of the gasoline infused? Kerosene and incense. Yeah, we can try it. Thanks. Oh, how has your keep people thinking Osamu is alive been going? About that. What if when he gets burned that they heard Osamu scream? If that happened, no one would doubt that he had died then. That's a good idea, but how do we do that? I've got just a thing right here. A voice recorder? Yes, with this we can record a scream. 
But how are we going to do that? You think of something. Why is that my job? Oh yeah. Also, this voice recorder can adjust pitch. So say you get a girl scream. We can pitch it lower. That way we can make it sound like it was his. Oh, okay. I got it. Out of all of us, who would be the easiest to get to scream? Is there even someone like that? Misaki is taking a shower. Is Misaki someone who screams easily? What should I do? If I go and pull the shower curtains open, she'd surely scream at that. But I don't think that's the way to do it. I got it. If I turn off the lights in here, would Misaki get scared? Alright, let's try that idea. Instantly, the room goes dark. Ah! What? what? A power outage? Alright, I've gotten her to scream. With this, we'll be able to use it for our plan. Thanks, Misaki. Now that I have her scream, I turn the lights back on. The lights are back. Ugh, you scared me. How odd. Someone's pranking me. S sorry, Misaki. I wait until Misaki is no longer looking for me and then slip out. Did you record a scream? Yep. Oh, you did it. Good work. How is this? I play the voice recorder for Maki. The scream from before plays out of the recorder. I see, you got Misaki. Well, with this, I can adjust it. Oh, good. I also looked into how long the incense burns. It looks like it'll take about 30 minutes for one stick. I'll set the voice recorder to go off then to make it look like Osamu is alive. This way, the timing will match up with the burning. I see. Leave setting up the tools and lighting the incense to me. Are you okay with the fire starting at around 3 a.m. tonight? That way, there's enough time to create our alibis. Sure thing. I'll give you all the tools then. The kerosene bottles and incense, huh? I'll make sure no one can find them. Please do. Alright, there's something I gotta prepare first. Hmm? Prepare? What needs to be? Huh? What you saying? When the fire starts, wouldn't it be bad if someone found the voice recorder? Oh, yeah. When the fire starts, a lot of people are gonna come in here. It needs to absolutely be taken back. I see. Do your best. I'll have to put the voice recorder close to the body. Well then, we'll meet again when the body burns. Yeah, got it. 